Today we have a box full of dinosaurs, sea animals, animals, and lots of cool stuff. Yeah. Are you a dinosaur yet? Subscribe to become one now. Hey all dinosaurs, I'm Dan and this is Mr. Connector. Hello, I'm Mr. Connector. And today we have plenty of dinosaurs, sea animals, animals and lots of other cool stuff inside this huge, huge, huge box. So let's get started. Okay guys, so let's get started. First item, Mr. Connector, can you please help me to pick an item? This one right over here. Okay, let's have a look at what's inside this surprise seashell. Three, two, one. Cool. Oh, we have a 3D puzzle of a seahorse. Really cool. Seahorse. Okay, let's proceed to the next item. A great white shark. No, Dan, this is not a great white shark. This is a megalodon. Oh, are you sure? Let me have a look. Hmm, maybe. Let's have a look at the name. Hmm, no name is written below. This is probably a great white shark or probably a megalodon. Definitely a megalodon. You guys decide and let us know down in the comment section below. Let's proceed to the next one. Over here, we have a beautiful Triceratops from Imagine Next. Mm, this Triceratops, can it move? Um, is that a button? Yes, right over here. Pretty cool. And you can actually put a man on top of this Triceratops. Really cool. Mr. Connotor, why are you so quiet? Please help me to pick another item. What about this one right over here? Okay, this one. Looks like we have a couple of glow and the duck dinos. Not really dinos, we have prehistoric animals, flying reptiles, and let's have a look at all these glow and the duck figures, okay? Wow, cool! Really, really awesome! Great choice, Mr. Connor Next, pick the blue. T-Rex, the blue T-Rex right over here and it's actually on top, I mean below this shark right over here. I think this is a tiger shark because of all these black stripes. Pretty cool. <laughs> so cool, I like it. And we have an egg over here. We are going to open this later on, but Mr. Connor wants to have a look at this huge T-Rex. This T-Rex, it's from Imagine Next. You guys could be familiar with this. Very cool. I like it a lot. We have another one right over here. Oh, that one is awesome. I want to see it as well. Okay, no problem, but please hold on. Let's have a look at this. Three, two, one. Okay, so we have a brand new pack. I've actually cut this open up. Looks like we have a 3D puzzle of a nice... Oh, I know what dinosaur this is. Do you guys know what dinosaur this is? Please shout out before I actually tell you the name. Shout out what is the name of this dinosaur. It is actually a Spinosaurus, the spine lizard. Cool. Let's move on. Okay, let me remove the plastic bag. Mr. Connotor, which one should we go next? Uh, the glow and the dark Tyrannosaurus Rex skeleton. Okay, good choice. This is another cool one which I've bought in um, Kuala Lumpur. Okay, let's have a look at this. Let me switch off the lights. Cool! Really awesome glow and the dark skeleton. And what is this? What is this, Mr. Connotor? This it's a shock. Okay, great job, Mr. Connor. This is definitely a great white shock from Schleich. Nice one. Another one. And what is this? Another. Oh, this is actually a bull shock. Nice. 
a raptor from Imagine Next. And speaking of Imagine Next, do you guys want me to do like a collection video of Imagine Next dinosaur action figures? Take a look at this dino fortress right behind. It is super, super awesome. Let's get it, get this out of the way. Um, some surprise seashell. Who looks like we have Nemo? Nemo. Oh, is that Nemo? Please hold on, Mr. Connor Let me fix this up. Mm, okay, like this. Yes, I think this is Nemo. This is definitely Nemo. I want to eat him. No way, Mr. Connor This Nemo, it's pretty cool. I like it. This is actually a clownfish. Okay, the next figure, or right, the next action figure. We have this super cool in that. It's not Imagine Next Indominus Rex. Let me show you guys why it is super cool. Switch off the lights now. Check this out. From orange turning into bright red. Really cool. Let me show you guys once more, okay? Three, two, one. Off the lights. From orange to. Still orange. That's fine. Let's try this again. It is red now. How cool is this? Super cool. I'm pretty sure that you guys have seen this many times, but this is still a super cool dinosaur. Okay, right over here. This is actually my latest addition to my Imagine Next um, collection. Okay, so basically you can place this guy on top of it. You press it down, you can see this launcher at the side. Okay, so basically it will launch a boulder. Okay, this boulder can be placed over here and drop it onto this launcher. And once you press it, it will throw that boulder. Super cool. As you guys can see, it has thrown it super, super far. And on top of this, this is actually a pretty cool T-Rex. Um, action figure okay let's move on let's move on and where are you mr connor i'm right over here okay next i want you to open um that green dinosaur egg okay but i'm i'm not too sure whether it is a dinosaur or animal figure inside but let's open this okay seems like we have another sea animal oh this is cool we have a whale and take a look at this. This is actually the surface of the sea with a boat on top of it. Really beautiful. A core tails. Okay, next. Oh, this is cool. This is actually a dinosaur balloon. Let me blow this up for you guys to have a look. Really, really cute. Just one second. Take check this out, guys. When I was blowing it, it was actually producing a loud sound. And let me release this. So cute, right? This should be an Ankylosaurus. Okay, next. More glow in the dark um, figures. Seems like we have an Iguanodon. I'm not too sure what this is. The other one should be a Trodon. Beautiful glow in the dark action figures. No action figures mini figures what is this this is a whale shark a whale shark it's a filter feeder which means it can suck in all the water and filter out all the food particles next we have another megalodon megalodon no this is definitely not a megalodon this is definitely a great white shark okay naughty naughty okay the next one let's pick uh, the orange dinosaur the orange one, okay, let's have a look at this. Okay, this it's a Ceratosaurus from Imagine Next Cool. Another Megalodon. Megalodon. Nope, this is another great white shark. If you guys can see it, it's written right below. Okay, another Megalodon. Megalodon. Okay, um nope, this is another great white shark. Why are there so many great white sharks? I've no idea as well. Okay, next, um, this is actually a um, Chronosaurus, if I remember correctly, I'm not too sure, but 
there should be a Chronosaurus. A very cute one is um, indeed. Check this out. Okay, the next one we have a Velociraptor. Velociraptor, I love to eat Velociraptors. Nope, nope, naughty, naughty. Okay, next we have another great white shark. Oh my goodness, we have so many great white sharks. Next we have Godzilla Fundo Monotaurus. <laughs> okay, so this is actually a Godzilla toy. This belongs to my kids. Okay, let's move on. We have a basking shark. This is cool. This is another filter feeder. Okay, the next one we have a Quetzal Coatlers. Oh, a flying dinosaur. Flying dinosaur? There's no such thing as flying dinosaur. This is a prehistoric flying reptile. Oh, okay, whatever. Okay, let's move on. Okay, we have this beautiful uh, tiger figurine from PNSO. Cool. More sharks. This is actually a shark ray. A shark ray is shark ray, a shark or a ray. It is actually not a shark nor a ray. Yes, it is a unique species. Okay, what do we have over here? We have a pteranodon, I think, from Imagineland, and this pteranodon can actually flap its wings. Cool. Okay, this is definitely a um, uh, flying dinosaur. This should be a pteranodon as well from Imagine Next. Cool. Spinosaurus. Oh my arc enemy, but I am way stronger than him. Um, I'm not too sure about that, Mr. Conotor, because Spinosaurus is actually the largest land carnivorous dinosaur. Cool. It is a um, quadrupedo um, semi-aquatic dinosaur. Okay, let's move on. Okay, we have a beautiful, beautiful Tyrannosaurus Rex. Um, okay, Godzilla is not really a Tyrannosaurus Rex, but it is definitely inspired um, from a Tyrannosaurus Rex mixed with a Stegosaurus and probably some other reptiles. This is cool. You rotate this and swing its tail. Awesome, awesome. Okay, let's move on. We have a beautiful, beautiful blue whale from Collecting. Oh, I love blue whales. I want to eat them. Um, blue whales are actually much larger than you, Mr. Conotaurus. So I don't think you can eat them. Okay, next we have a T Rex car. How cool is this? This is really cool. Actually, one like this. Check this out, guys. Okay, let's move on. Um, this should be another raptor from Imagine Next as well. So once again, you can place a figure of a human, of a warrior on top of it. Let's move on. A brown bear. Whew, I love brown bears. They look so adorable, but they are super ferocious. Um, a goat. Zebras. Zebras have unique stripes. Oh, delicious. Naughty, naughty. What's next? Okay, this is a pteranodon from National Geographic. I love National Geographic. Do you guys watch National Geographic? Oh, we have a fidget spinner. I love fidget spinners. I love fidget spinners. You love them? Okay, let me show you guys. This is actually cool because you can switch on the lights. Check this out. And once, oopsie, my camera, and want to turn it, it will produce this beautiful, beautiful circular motion light. Really awesome. Let's spin this once more. I know, I know, fidget spinners, they are out of trend, but they are so fun to play with. I love them. Okay, let's move on to the next item. Let me switch off the lights. Okay, you have to press two times for it to be turned off. Okay, let's move on. Oh, I see a Spider-Man right over there. What is the Spider-Man doing inside this box? Okay, this is another cool um, Spider-Man. Check this out. 
shoo, 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 shoo. Oh, I love it. I love it. Oh, glow in the dark. Yes, this figure is actually super, super cool. Okay, next we have the Stegosaurus, which is also super fun. Okay, my boulder is actually right over there, so I'm not going to show you guys. So basically, you can place a boulder right over here and launch it. Okay, let me place this. Launch it like this. Three, two, one. That's kind of cool, right? Okay, let's move on. So basically, this is like a dino... Dinosaur money jar. Or rather like a dinosaur piggy bank. We have seen this before, so let me get it out of the way. Oh, we have a transforming dinosaur rack. Let's transform this. What dinosaur is this? Is this a Petasaurus or a Brachiosaurus? Okay, so this is actually a Brachiosaurus. If you notice the two front legs, they are actually longer than the hind legs. So it is actually nicknamed the Arm Lizard. And check this out, there's a little bump over here. Only Brachiosaurus have, have this little bump. The Apatosaurus does not have this little bump. Okay, next we have a Sahara Recurs from Imagine Next. This is super cool. Let's fire this arrow right over here. Three, two, one. Super awesome. This is actually a Sahara Recurs. The prehistoric animal, I suppose. Next, okay, this figure is absolutely amazing. This is from Nikar, okay, which is a, um, oh, sorry, this is from Toho, but this is so heavy. There's so many joints of articulation. One, two, three points of articulation on each leg, and check out the tail. You can rotate it right over here, 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 here. One, two, three, four. Four points of articulation on the tail. You can even uh, bend the fingers, the wrist. Super awesome. Giraffe, the tallest land animal. Um, hippopotamus. Is this a spring bog? Too sure. Elephant, okay. The largest land animal. What is this? This is actually like a prehistoric cat. This should be a Smaldon. If you uh, take a look at those two huge canine teeth, very cool, very fun to play with. More animals. Hyena, can be found in Africa. We have Cheetah, the fastest land animal. What is this? A wolf. Wolves, they are very loyal animals. I think they only, only has one partner throughout their entire life. Okay, so they are very, very loyal. This is a cow, a lion, one of my most favorite animals. Oh, dogs. Yes, dogs. I love dogs. Good and retrievers. I lost my dog recently and I was so upset. But right now I'm getting better. This is a buffalo, um, a horse, Another Godzilla, and this is also from Toho, an original Bandai figurine of a Godzilla. Rhinoceros, oh, I love rhinoceros. Rhinoceros are actually my top three most favorite animals of all time, okay? Number one, um, usually it's lion, but some, I mean, right now, I kind of like rhinos. Pandas. We have a crocodile. I love crocodiles as well because they look like prehistoric dinosaurs. They definitely looks like uh, like dino suitors, psycho suitors. And the last figure of the day is a pig. Okay, that's cute. Yeah. So check this out guys, plenty of toys. I hope that you guys enjoy this little video I've made for you guys as much as I enjoy uh, what am I talking about as much as I enjoy making this video okay so 
So yes, I am Dan. I upload dinosaur and animal videos every single day. So make sure you hit the subscribe button right in the face, okay? And press the little bell icon to receive notifications whenever I upload a video. Thanks for amazing support. Do you guys like Mr. Connor Tall? If you guys want Mr. Connor Tall to appear more in my videos, just leave a comment down below. Do you guys like me? I'm Bisha. I'm the most handsome dinosaur on earth. I'm not too sure about Mr. Connor Tall. So yes, let us know in the comments whether you guys want Mr. Connor Tall to appear. Okay, before you go, you know, just give it a bit of thumbs up, share it, drop me a comment, and I will definitely like it. Before you go, check the previous videos right now. Okay? 